So yeah, I've recently started using the Ray One lens, and I think it's got a lot of great benefits for surgeons. Uh, number one, it's it's a preloaded lens uh, that may, so you don't have to worry about having you know an injector and then a cartridge and loading that and making sure those things are sterile. It's a single-use, disposable, preloaded system that is very efficient and effective, uh, and it basically just simplifies that whole process for surgeons and their staff. So basically, it's a two-step system. Number one, it's placing viscoelastic inside the injector, and number two is closing the wings and then injecting the lens. It's quite simple. So uh, traditional lenses are folded to get them into the uh, cartridge so that they can uh, be implanted inside the eye. The lock and roll system uh, with Rainer is unique. What it does is roll the lens. That has some benefits, so by rolling the lens, it can actually go through a smaller cartridge and thus a smaller incision. Also, I think it has some benefits. You know that that lens is not being damaged. It's rolled rather than folded. So I think there might be some optical benefits as well. But uh, basically, it allows for a more simple way, an efficient way to implant the lens inside the eye through a smaller cartridge. So uh, we've been using the Rainer lens for a good year and a half. Uh, we've probably placed over three or 4,000 lenses. We've found that the, uh, number one, it's a very safe lens. It's easy to implant. Um, you know, you don't have a stiff haptic to worry about or, uh, you know, a complicated unfolding system. It unfolds quickly and efficiently. Uh, the optical quality is very high. I've not seen glistenings uh, with this lens, so it's very clear optic, very uh, stable both short term and long term. What's nice is when it opens up inside the eye, I can do an uh, intraoperative aberrometry uh, reading within minutes because this hydrophilic material uh, opens quickly. Uh, also that has long-term stability, the haptics. Uh, it has this dual haptic design that gives it the stability with inside the bag so you don't have to worry about contraction or lens movement over time. So we've been really happy with the, the, the Rainer lens platform over the past year and a half and I think the Ray One just takes that level up a little bit uh, with uh, sort of ease uh, and simplicity. So I think preloaded systems are definitely uh, uh, what we're going to see more and more of. It's, it, it allows for a more simple environment in the operating room. However, with that said, some of the other systems have a complex loading process where maybe you have to you know, uh, turn or click or move uh, uh, components of the uh, cartridge to engage that loading system. And if, it's, if the uh, preloaded lens is more complicated than a self-loading lens, it can kind of take away from the purpose of why you're having it. What's nice with the Ray One, it's so simple, it's literally two steps. Viscoelastic inside the injector, close the wings, and then you're ready to go. You don't have multiple steps that you have to remember or have a point of you know, possibly you know, mixing something up or, or failing with the uh, injector process. So I think it's just a much more simple system than what I've seen with other platforms. So it's great to work with Rainer. You know, from a historical perspective, they created the first intraocular lens ever implanted in man. Sir Harold Ridley uh, implanted that first lens uh, years ago, and it's got a great historical perspective to, to know that the history that's gone be, uh, behind this platform goes back to the original IOL, and to see where it's come today, it's, it's, it's basically gives you a great feeling that you're working with a strong company.